To rotate a specific graphic or text box, click the item and then click the circle arrow icon at the top. Here you can rotate right or left by large or small increments. To scale a graphic or text box, click the box and arrow icon at the top and you can scale up by bigger or smaller increments as well as scale down by smaller or bigger increments. You can also scale by clicking and dragging the corners of your selected item. To crop an image, click the image and then click the crop icon at the top. Your image will pop up. If you hover over the edges of your graphic, arrows will appear. Click down and drag the edge to where you want it to be cropped. You'll see the dimensions of your image adjust below. You can also hover over the graphic and a moving cursor will appear. Drag the cropped area over any part of your image to crop. Click crop when you are finished. Place order just means moving the aspect you have selected in front of or behind other aspects of your design. So click the double box icon at the top and you can bring it all the way to the front, just one step ahead, just one step behind, or all the way to the back. To move a graphic or text box, click on the item and hold down as you move it around or click the arrows icon at the top. Here you can move your item up by bigger or smaller moves, right by bigger or smaller moves, down by bigger or smaller moves, and left by bigger or smaller moves. To delete an unwanted aspect of your design, click on the item. You can either click the trash can icon within the template editing section or up on top. When it asks if you're sure you want to remove, click OK. In the bottom left hand corner of the designing screen is a camera icon that reads Capture. If you click this icon, it will save a copy of your current design as a snapshot. If ever you want to go back to a previous design, just click the arrow above the camera icon to see all of your snapshots and select the one you want. You can even see all your saved snapshots at once by clicking Compare. Just be aware that after you load a previous snapshot design, your current design will be lost. If you want to save your current design, take a snapshot of that version as well. You can delete any saved snapshot by clicking the trash can icon in the upper right hand corner of each snapshot box. While you're designing, keep in mind a few extras at the top of your screen. Share It allows you to share your design with others on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, or Pinterest. Send Email allows you to send your design to someone via email. Just add the email or emails separated by commas, write a quick message, and click Send. Save Design allows you to save your current design for future projects or products. Just type in your design's name and click Save. A new section will appear featuring a computer and paintbrush icon. Here is where you will find all your designs that are saved. If you want to delete a design, simply click the trash can in the upper right hand corner of the design.